Hi, I'm Jeff Rabinowitz, uh, Head of Operations for Loft. This is our new INT center where we build satellites. Let's come inside and take a look. This is our inventory and receiving area where all materials that come into the facility come in to get cataloged and put into our bonded stock room. Those materials then get kitted into kits, they get issued to the floor that are used to build the satellites. Critical long lead materials are identified on an advanced parts list. We buy those materials long in advance of ever having a customer, so when the customer's ready, so are we. Welcome to the INT Center. This is where the magic really happens. Let's talk about our hub, Loft's standard way of adapting satellites to accommodate payloads. Over here, we have a flight product stack. It's one of the key components in the hub and allows us to control and communicate with payloads in the space vehicle. This is our payload accommodation module, otherwise known as the PAN. It's a standard mechanical and electrical interface that allows us to integrate payloads to the space vehicle. Part of what allows Loft to go so fast is that we send a hub kit out, a replica of all the IO that you'd see in the vehicle to our payload providers. They develop the unit level testing and the scripts that we then incorporate into a reference hub and validate at the system level before integrating into a vehicle. When a satellite arrives at Loft, the first thing we do is do a receive inspection and a receive functional test. Once we know the hardware is good, we can put it on the shelf. When the payload and the PAM is ready, then we can pull those things down, integrate them into the satellite, and we've got a vehicle ready to go. Once all the payloads have been integrated to the space vehicle, it's time to test it. We hook it up to a test rack and we validate that everything is functional before moving it through to environments. Welcome to our environmental test center where we have the capability to do unit system level testing for thermal, vibration, and T-back. After we put everything together and we functionally tested it, it's time to go through a vibe check. We install the vehicle to the separation system and the deployment mechanism that separates it from the launch vehicle, and we simulate the launch loads so that we can make sure that we're safe all the way to orbit. This is our thermal chamber where we put the vehicle through thermal cycles to simulate the space environment before we run it through a final functional test and send it off to launch. You've just seen how Loft is able to process satellites at scale. The next thing we do with these is we pack them up and send them off to launch. The next time we see these satellites, we'll be launching them and talking to them in orbit. 